Swimming is a type of recreation that has extremely positive health effects. Swimming achieves the aerobic effects of physical activity while strengthening all the muscle groups in our body. Water resistance that is 10 to 15 times higher than air resistance further enhances the efficiency of swimming and muscle strengthening as if we are exercising with weights. Swimming strengthens the cardiovascular system, stabilizes blood pressure, deepens breathing, increases lung capacity and improves oxygen supply. In addition, it positively affects the joints, increases their mobility and elasticity, and has a positive effect on the coordination of movement. Deep breathing that we are forced to swim is actually the kind of breathing that is recommended when we want to relax, reduce anxiety, anxiety, or reduce stress because deep breathing lowers the level of cortisol, the stress hormone. Responsible for our troubled state. Swimming strengthens the entire musculature of the body, arms, shoulders, back, chest, buttocks and legs, gaining fitness and endurance. In this world, there is nothing milder or more subtle than water. And yet, she overcomes unyielding hardness, and nothing is equal to her. Swimming also consumes a significant number of calories, over 60 minutes of freestyle swimming, you burn 500 to 700 calories. 750 calories our body burns when we swim in breaststroke for 60 minutes. 800 calories are consumed during a 60-minute butterfly-style swim. 500 calories are lost during a 60-minute backstroke swim. How often and long to swim? For best effect, it is recommended to swim for 30 minutes daily. If this is not possible, swimming three times a week for about 30 minutes also has a great effect. If there are difficulties in continuous swimming, it can be started with a shorter duration with a gradual lengthening or there may be breaks in swimming, recreational activity, except for rules other than those requiring specific health status. Physical activity should be a pleasure to us, so it should be adapted to our personality as this is the only way we will not give up. We have to choose the swimming style of the goal we want to achieve, comfort, recreation, building strong muscles, fitness, mobility. Which swimming style to choose? If there is no health barrier, contraindication, it is best to combine all the styles as this will achieve the best effect and evenly develop all the muscles of the body. If the goal is to develop great strength of the shoulders, back and legs, a butterfly swimming style is recommended. This style is technically the most demanding, and is also very demanding in terms of strength and balance of breathing and movement. KVRL is one of the most common swimming styles. If we swim at a faster pace this is the style that is recommended when we want aerobic effects. Chest style is a slower swimming technique that requires more strength of the shoulders and legs. For diseases in the cervical spine, one should be cautious and prefer to opt for a dorsal swimming style. The back style is recommended for those who have spinal problems, pain, poor posture, deformities.